Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on Deadly PKers. Um, it's a really good private server. I suggest you guys uh, should come and play it. It's really fucking fun. And God, I'm getting like, what the? F How did they edit that? How did they fucking edit? Anyway, so <clears throat> basically, oh my God, get the fuck off my balls! I'm gonna just. Do not disturb. Fuck you and fuck your eyes, bitch. Anyway, <clears throat> basically, when you log into the server, um, you will see the screen right here. Um, you, you just get on dpk or no dpk client.net and you'll get on this uh, little page here. And you don't need to register or anything, just uh, just take a random username and random password but of course you should remember them because otherwise you can't log back uh, log back into the account and um, you know the, the client actually does save your password and your username so um, yeah but still but still just remember your username and your password just in case something happens you know so I'm just gonna log into a random account I haven't created this one yet just so you guys know I haven't registered I haven't done shit you just log in with a random username and a random password so I'm just gonna log in uh, with um, I don't know uh, tutorial on serve whatever tutorial on SE and the password should be um, you know what whoever watches this video first can get the account the password is banana phone <clears throat> anyway so you start off with this shit right here. It's really fucking good shit. It might look like like really newbie shit that nobody wants, but it's really fucking good. So <clears throat> when you start off the server, you can you can teleport home or you can go and kill monsters. Which uh, I personally think you should kill monsters first, just so you you can get your combat up and you know stuff like that. But you can also be a skiller, so it doesn't matter. Um, as you can see, I already have 850k, but you can get a bunch of more money if you go to the stall right here. And as you guys can see, I just, th uh, you know, I just did thieving one time and I got up to level 10 and then 15 and 18. You know, it's really fucking easy. And you can sell these things for, um, let's see how much each. I'm not sure. Yeah, 9k each. You get 9k per per cake. And once you go to a higher level, you can take this one. You, c you get cloth, I believe. And you can take this one. Um... Uh, it was like dust or something. I don't know. You get random stuff from these things, and you can sell them there at the store right there, and you can get a bunch of money. And you can also vote. Uh, if you vote, uh, then you can you can get vote points. Uh, you'll see the vote on top of your screen right there. You can all you can get a fire cape with votes. You can you can get a top hat, crystal ball, and a fighter hat. It's really nice. And. Uh, <clears throat> So you can see that the server is really, really crowded. There's a lot of people here who play, and it's really active and really fun. Um, this is the spawn. Like most people come here to thieve. They come here to talk to people. You know, become friends. Like start PKing. Like everything here. It's really fun here. And you can also go to the marketplace if you want to buy and sell stuff. Uh, there is no trade option in the spawn. They just did this so. Um, yeah, they just did this so you wouldn't trade in the spawn and you would trade in the marketplace instead. So the marketplace will be, uh, you know, more famous than the spawn itself. I mean, not more famous. I mean, more of a crowded place, whatever. Uh, I don't know how to say it because I'm not really English or anything like that. I'm Swedish, actually. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> anyway, so you can buy and sell stuff here. If you have anything important, you can buy, you, you know, you can sell your bronze, d uh, bronze arrows, your fire runes and everything. You can actually check all of the prices in the game if you do slash slash. I mean, that, that, I don't know what the fuck that is, but you can check the chat box and do um, prices. And then another screen opens up. As you guys can see, the only the other screen opened up and you can search for the item you want. Let's say you want a rune. No, wait, rune isn't. Just take rare items and, you know, good items, like, uh, let's say a dragon fire shield. If, if it says zero, then it means uh, you can sell it for whatever price you like and buy it for whatever pr price you like. But uh, if it has a price like this, you can also do it. You can also sell and buy it for uh, as much as you want. But most people will see this and probably won't go for it. So let's say you buy a, you successfully buy a Dragonfire Shield for 35 mil, which is the lowest price. 
and you want to sell it for 36 mil nobody is gonna buy that so just try selling it for you know 40 mil or um, yeah just try selling it for 40 mil or 45 mil somewhere in between that and start buying it for 40 and 35 mil don't try to uh, to go over this limit don't try to buy uh, dragon fire shield for 20 mil and then selling it for 60 mil that's not that shit's never gonna work okay don't even try that so uh, that's the economy and uh, now we're gonna go to the training <coughs> So uh, you can see all the teleports here. There's a teleport for monster monster teleport. There's a minigame teleport. You can do pest control. You can get a bunch of rewards there. Um, there's there's a fight arena, zombie minigame, du dual arena too, and you can stake actually. And there's uh, boss teleports and a lot of shit like that. <coughs> We're gonna go and train now. We're gonna go to the rock crabs. You can also go to the tavalry uh, tavalry. Tavl whatever I don't fucking know what it's called dungeon and you can get a bunch of uh, dragon bones and sell them for really high prices let's see how much a dragon bone costs um, yeah 300 to 200k each it's it's really nice it's really really nice anyway so the, f the easiest stat to train up is probably magic because you can have uh, you can have auto cast and you can also uh, you can also alchemy at the same time like let's say you're doing this I just hit, yeah you see I got really really high levels right there and I didn't even do anything see I just I level uh, you level up so quickly in magic on the server look I can just click like really really fast and we almost have alchemy there almost have alchemy once you have alchemy just start doing this just click there and do that while hitting crabs at the same time so you get the maximum amount of experience it's probably gonna get patched but uh, you should do it while you still can and it, now I can also do better spells like that one try not to do fire spells because <coughs> alchemy requires fire runes and um, and yeah, the fire runes will probably run out before you uh, you really get a really high level. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, I don't know how long I've been training magic for. I've just killed two crabs, and I al already have fucking 69 magic. That's fucking awesome, guys. You should really play on this server. It's really fucking amazing. It's really fun to play on. And trust me, the, the economy, like the people, um, the community, everything is just so fun on this server. So just get on, play, and... Add me in game, you know. Um, so wait, that's the magic. Okay, let, now let's let's train some strength, just so you guys know how fast it is. Okay, but uh, strength isn't as fast as as mage, but it's still it's still pretty fast, if you ask me. Uh, in my personal opinion, you should get the attack first and then strength, because then you can wield the rune scimitar, and then you know then you can get your strength up, or you can just wield the dragon scimitar. It doesn't matter. And guys, if you actually accidentally train up your defense, you can you can do stat reset. <coughs> you can reset your defense level and uh, you know and get it to level one, even if you have 99, I believe. I'm not sure though. <coughs> um, sorry, sorry about my uh, my throat. It's a bit, yeah, whatever. Anyway, so as you guys can see, it's really easy to train up your strength and attack, and defense is also really fast but I'm not gonna train that in case there's somebody who takes this account uh, if you do take the account I'm not sure how you can uh, switch passwords but you can probably do commands I think commands no there is no commands yeah I have no idea how you do that <coughs> by the way you can see the rules right here by clicking on them and you can check just gonna click the rules wow okay I'm gonna need to get farther away from that crab ah it says do not bug abuse do not advertise other servers do not sell your dpk for anything other than dpk stuff i think it, it means uh... daily pk or stuff i don't know uh... do not disrespect or impersonate staff members do not hack other players do not ddos you get ip'd for this one do not scam, do not strike uh, letters in yell, do not multi-log auto talker on sev 7 seconds minimum. You know Jagex should have this option but whatever. If you need further help, delipcares.net. Here you 
Ha? Kan du ringa pappa? Nej, inte nu. Senare. Nej. Snälla, snälla. Gå bort, gå bort, gå ut. Nej, gå, ut. gå ut, jag håller på i en video. Fan, gå ut härifrån. Snälla, jag skulle prata med pappan sen. <laughs> Stäng dörren efter dig. Sorry about that, that was my sister, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna cut that out, because I'm, I'm a really lazy guy. Uh, it says here you'll find guides on everything, you'll find hints and, uh, and tips, you'll find monster locations, you'll be able to make password recovery, you can report players, you can sell in-game items, you can get known. I'm getting known on YouTube, fuck that shit. <laughs> um, so, we've, uh, we've done this. We've checked the rules, we've done the training, now I can just show you the Taverly Dungeon and it's a really good way to make money, so I'm just gonna show you guys that really quickly and then probably, um, th probably that's when the video will end. Um, you can glitch the Taverly Dungeon by taking a bow, <coughs> bow and arrow, go through it and attack a random blue dragon. I'm not sure if you can do it or not, but I've s I saw another guy do it with a dark bow. Uh, okay, now go through this thing and just attack the blue dragon from here. You can't do crap, but you will get a bunch of experience. I'm already level 9, uh, 31. <laughs> and keep in mind that one dragon bone is 200, um, it's 200k, so it's really good experience and really good money. And you know what, after I kill this dragon, I'm probably going to show you guys the general store and what you can, you can buy there. Because there's a bunch of shit in the general, general store that you can buy, you know, when you're a new player. You can buy uh, rune, you can buy, um, you can buy rune arrows, you can buy bows, you can buy uh, magic stuff, you can buy everything there. Or actually, you'll probably find it yourself, you know, just go to Edgeville and you'll find, um, you'll find the general store just by clicking on the world map. I think you can click on the world map, I'm not sure about that, but you'll find it. You'll find it. It's not that hard. <sighs> Alright, this is taking way too long. I'm just going to show you guys the general store. Whatever. <coughs> I just I just want everything to be on this video so you guys can um, can do this by yourselves later when you're in here. And so no admins need to help you later on. Um, here's the shop, shop assistant. He sells everything in here. Um, but it's the really shitty one because everything costs so much. You can buy gloves. You can buy uh, the admin gloves if you have one defense. You can buy a cape of legends. You can buy Zamra cape. I'm gonna buy the Zamra cape. You can also buy these things. And they don't cost that much, you know. They cost like fucking like not even that much, like 8k each. You can just go and steal a cake for that. <laughs> and here's the amulets, the boots, um, fuck uh, the good weapons, the gr granite mall. can't do that because I need 50 attack but you guys get the point right you can also get stuff over here magic stuff here you can buy runes blah 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 I'm just gonna you can also do 1k 1 mil like you can do this look you can do 1k instead of typing 1 0 0 0 you don't have to type 1 0 0 0 just do 1k and that's fine anyway guys this tutorial has been way too fucking long uh, I shouldn't have uh, taking this long to finish a fucking private server tutorial, but that's just how it is guys and uh, Please comment rate and subscribe to this, uh, you know on this channel if you don't like private servers, then I'm sorry But there's nothing I can do about that. You know if you don't like them then just f go fuck yourself All right, all right thanks. I'm just kidding. Okay. Fuck don't fuck yourself. Just just eat my balls instead. What the? F yes, and fuck my eyes Bitch. Bye, guys.